I'm here in the capital of the United States of America, Washington, D.C., District of Columbia. The reason I'm here is I am attending the AGU Fall Meeting 2018. It's the Saturday before the meeting, and today it's just all about tourism, to be honest. The one thing I cannot stress enough is just how huge everything is. It is Monday morning, it's nearly eight o'clock and the main event is just about to begin. Welcome to the AGU Fall Meeting 2018 here in the Washington uh, Convention Center. Now, yesterday I picked up my name badge, so that's what gets me access to see everything. I am giving a talk later today, uh, which I have checked in. Everything should be working absolutely fine. But right now, I want to check out some other people's talks. So let's go. Right, I've just got out of my talk. That's, uh, <laughs> that's the big worry over. That was presenting the science results from our citizen science and sonification stuff. Seemed to go down pretty well. Quite a few interested questions. I do have some other presentations this week, but that was a big one done. I'm going to get the posters now. Welcome to the AGU poster hall. The scale of this thing is just immense. The place has such a, a buzzing atmosphere and that happens throughout the day. There are poster sessions in the morning, in the afternoon, and there are people here all the time. It's really promoting some great discussion of science and it's probably the biggest poster hall I have ever seen. So as well as poster presentations, there are these e-lightning presentations as well. How do they work? Well, it starts out with a lightning presentation, three minutes elevator pitch for your work. But then everyone stands around these interactive touch screens and goes through their projects one-on-one, -on -one, very much like a poster presentation. But the benefit is you can have things like video, audio, a lot more interactive elements than you can with a piece of paper. In this session, I'm presenting SSFX, my art science film project. Okay, welcome to the exhibitors hall. You can see there are tons of stands here and they really, really vary from companies looking for uh, people with jobs, uh, from things with products, data services, and quite frankly, just a whole load of cool stuff and freebies. Let's have a look. So today is Friday and it's almost over for AGU, but not quite yet for me. I have one more presentation to do and it's a completely different format yet again. Uh, a lightning presentation plus panel discussion. I've not actually done one of those, so that's gonna be quite interesting. Once that's over, AGU 2018, dusted. But that's my time in Washington DC still not over. You see, because there are 26,000 scientists from all over the world who've attended this, it doesn't make sense not to make the most of it. So you get these splinter meetings as well. I went to one the weekend before. There's another one tomorrow. I've got two presentations at that. And once that's over, then I'm finally done. 